How's it going everybody? This is Ryoki here and welcome to part 18. So, uh, the vicious. Our rangers are having trouble holding them off. If we don't keep them back, they'll spread their radiation to the sun. There's no way we're having that. I'm not put, going to put any more lives in danger. Suit up. Let's go. Hi, Dad. Topaz. You're alright. I see you were in Vinaville when it happened. I thought I was sending you out of harm's way. I'm so sorry. I'm glad. I'm so glad you're okay. Now I'm going to make the. Going to do the best that I can to make things right. And I'll start by protecting the people of Legend and. Uh. Vinoville. Oh, it's Topaz. I see you showed up to help us spell the nuclear Pokemon. As much as I resent putting you in danger like this, I also want to see your Pokemon battling skills in action. Don't worry, Topaz. I'll keep you safe no matter. What? What? Come with me. Th there was something I wanted though. Listen up everyone. Beyond this point starts the hazard zone. Most of this side of the hill is sheltered from the fallout, but the nuclear Pokemon are encroaching into this area, irradiating the ground as they go. As you know, they are resistant to capture stylers. Using Pokemon to stop them is the most effective way. Pokemon who have trainers are more resistant to mind-altering effect of the radiation. They also recover more quickly, whereas humans are at greater risk of exposure. The air here is not very toxic because we are far away from the epicenter and protected by the mountain. Still, it is important to be cautious. Is everybody ready? Let's go! It's important to keep your sit. You can get infected more easy. Cool. Keep your Pokemon healthy, okay? Antidotes, cool. You can also have these as well. Ultra balls, cool. That's cool. Cause I didn't get stopped by the shop. <laughs> oh well. My steel Pokemon and I will help battle these nuclear Pokemon. Pokemon uh, steel is the only type that resists nuclear attacks other than nuclear itself. Okay, that's cool. We have medicine on hand to treat those who have been affected by radiation. Pokemon Rangers credo creed is to protect nature Pokemon and people we're willing to put our lives on the line to do so I'm here to help no I'm good thank you hi dad our goal is to subdue the feral nuclear Pokemon and prevent them from breaching the barrier additionally we have word from Rangers who have discovered some Pope People and Pokemon that are in danger. We must rescue them. Imperial law. And I will go on ahead. Let's move out. Huh. Sounds like an interesting Pokemon. Good morning, Topaz. This is Richie. Richie! Now's not the time! <laughs> Richie. Dang it. Nuclear Pokemon. Ooh. Oh, okay. I'm catching one of you if I can. Uh, okay, cool. Beat up. Sorry, does hardly anything. Pokeballs. Let's go Ultra Ball. One, two, three, caught. I wanted a nuclear Boshef. All right, leave me alone. She gave a name to Boshef. No. Okay, from now on, I gotta start taking him down. Now, I do have a Barand, and while that looks really cool, I just gotta take you out, man. I'm sorry. Unless it's a Pokemon I don't have, or unless it looks, like, amazingly cool, I'm not gonna pick it up. Like a tankin. 
That's cool. Am I gonna pick it up? Probably not. I probably should be picking these up, but... All I see is that free experience. Is that bad of me? I'm not sure. So, nuclear Pokemon are weak to everything. But, uh... The only things resistant to nuclear Pokemon is steel and nuclear Pokemon. Okay. Good job. Hold up. Look there. It looks like that Pokemon is in trouble. Topaz, let's fight this together. Imperilla. Bosh off in a tank core. Or trans trans cure. The heck is that, Dad? What do you have? <laughs> kind of scares me. Looks like it's a monkey. Wait. Realization kicking in three, two, one. Is that an evolved form for primate? I mean, I guess it could be because I, I know uh, Mankey's got. Oh no. Please hit dads. Okay. Fine with that. Fury swipes. I, I honestly think that's something that has to do with primate. That's kind of neat. Like, is it gonna be the driving force between me getting, uh, behind me getting one? No, I have a Mankey. I mean, I'll, I'll train it up eventually. Eventually. Um. Oh, that's something I want to talk about. Uh, speaking of Pokemon, I ended up getting a glass, uh, glass slug. Uh, back around 16, and just before 17, I just I. I forgot to say that. Nice work, kid. Those were some impressive battling skills. Here, let me heal your Pokemon for you. They didn't get hurt. Okay, Kellen, we need backup. Come quick. I'm on it. Hi, Otten. Otten. Okay, that looks kind of cool. I'm not going to lie. Stomp, if you live, I'm catching you. If you don't, okay. Nope. Now, I did hear an uh, interesting rumor that since nuclear Pokemon are kind of more of the ferals and crazies, that even if you have all eight badges, they may not listen to you because uh, they are essentially ferals. And I kind of like that. I kind of don't because I mean I understand they're irradiated. They they're crazy. They cray cray. Is that still a thing? Cray cray. Oh. Anyways. But yeah, um, I heard that and it's like, oh, well, one, thanks for the spoiler, I guess, even though I don't like spoilers, two, um, just kind of, kind of interesting, oh, oh, that, that really hurt, that bag, great ball, that really hurt. I don't like that. That actually made me very uneasy. Caught. I need to heal Bashev.
Good, good. Okay, so that comes up and to the left. Okay. No. No, what whatever you did, you, you hurt me. Run away. Like a little coward. Why? Atkins, please why? Please no. Okay, I know. You're trying to be uh, intimidating. It's adorable. I get it. Stop. Ah, oh, mommy. It's too many of them. They overwhelmed her. Topaz and I will take care of it. Yeah, hey, father son bonding time, I guess. Uh, if that that's a nuclear glass uh glass school, I'm getting that. I don't care. Please, whatever you do, don't one-shot the Gligar. Gli Gligar, not Gliscor. Because <laughs> I'm a derp. That's okay. Level 34. Use the assurance. Please live. Cool. You did live. That, that makes me very happy. Oh, nuclear slide. That's gonna hurt. That was targeted for me. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, stop. Okay, stop. <sighs> Bag. Great ball. If I don't catch it, I don't catch it. No issue. One. Two. Three. Caught. Awesome. It's a nuclear Gligar. Like any of you wouldn't have done it. Don't judge me. I know you. I know everyone would have done it. It's like, I, I would have caught it. It's like, yeah, I know. Uh. Imperilla. I can, uh. Emperilla, Emperilla, because it's like Emperor Gorilla. Okay, I can feel I uh, feel your energy starting to fade. It's radiation getting to you. It's okay. Don't worry. You're safe. My Rangers will protect. The heck? This isn't good. I can't let Perla be exposed to any more radiation. Topaz, are your Pokemon? So I need your no. We all need your help. Please, we're counting on you. Oh, so I'm fighting a double battle. That Arbok is so cool. I'm glad I picked up the, uh, the Ekans now. Oh, and it's even got the hazard symbol to it, too. Alright, let's go. Clear body. <laughs> My stats aren't lowered. And we'll go up. Bubble beam. Blow up. Where's Sheldon during all this, by the way? Three. Four. 
five. And you're out. I know, it's one, two, three, and you're out in baseball, but still. Froggy, I think I'm going to give you the XP share next and just uh, let you go ham. How's that sound? No, Froggy, don't go. Please, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Froggy! Oh. Rip, Froggy. Yeah, let's do it. And we're going to send out Avidan. Let's go. Computer Y. Let's use beat up and air cutter. Two. It's only got five shots to it now. Good job, good job. Yeah, Abaddon and Froggy are the next two that I really need to level up. Thank you, Topaz. We all owe you one. Yeah, yes, thank you. Is it over? Looks like the nuclear Pokemon have fled for now. This area is secure. Come with us. We'll take you to a safe place. not thank you enough for your help out there Topaz if you hadn't been able to pull through in the last minute we all would have been in serious trouble I'm I'm so glad seeing you battle with your Pokemon fighting alongside you it makes me wish I would gotten to know you better before Topaz well done as thanks for all the indispensable help you brought to the Tandor Rangers today please take this HMO4 strength let's go now, please, get as far far from the site as you can. You have four gym badges, right? I don't know much about training Pokemon Pokemon training, but I'm sure that your next badge is in Amertree Town. You'll have to go through Bay Coal Rainforest to get there, but based on how you handle those Pokemon today, I'm sure you can take care of yourself. Thanks, Dad. You, you you mean the world to me I even though we don't know each other all that well and team 79 dark pulse okay that could have been useful just kind of skimming the outskirts here and and super repel cool that's cool Let's read this. West Tandor Victory Road ahead. Oh, so this is where we're gonna come for the uh, the Tandor League. Cool. Well, you know what? I think since we had a couple of minutes over time on the uh, last episode and all that good stuff, and I can't walk straight. Apparently, if there's something up there. I guess that's the mark gonna visit this house real quick oh hello oh 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 you're a trainer yes <laughs> oh yes it's like yes this is wonderful news and, and you're traveling the region th th this is also a yes oh joy oh joy oh joy oh joys I'm I'm so glad you have come here <clears throat> allow me to introduce myself I am well you can just call me a tinker and that that is also what I do Okay, okay, so, trainer, you, you know the, uh, hidden machines, a HMs, yes, uh, of course you do. Well, I, I will let you in on a, uh, a secret. They suck. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they are weak moves, so weak, useless, Pokemon are not slaves, we have technology, and so, this is what I do. I tinker. I make machines that do the work of HMs. Here, trainer, I, I, I want you to have this. Obtain rock smashing device. 
Okay. That machine, it crushes rocks. Yes, it crushes rocks that are in your way. Poof. Yes, no more rock. It's a miracle. Now, your, your Pokemon, get, get to rest easy. And you, my friend, can also rest easy. Someday, there, there will be no need for these HMs. But until then, I tinker. You are a nutcase. <laughs> Go away. I am busy. But soon, soon I will have more tools for you. So I'm going to be Batman. That, honestly, like, I love the idea of HMs getting eradicated. We have tools and stuff like that to be able to um, progress without make, making the HM slaves, which every person that's played Pokemon knows that you're always going to have a HM slave. One Pokemon that you just load up on HMs and go from there. And it's a sad truth. It does, they, it does suck. It really does. But I'm so glad that uranium again fans who made a game for fans know that we don't like that and with uh, Sun and Moon coming up spoilers okay that was your warning um, from the trailers that I've seen uh, essentially uh, it looks like we're not gonna have HMs anymore and that that looks uh kind of interesting so yeah end of spoilers I'm gonna buy stuff uh, ultra ball great ball No, I would. I know. I, I would not like anymore. Okay, cool. Think what I am going to do. Is I'm going to heal up my Pokemon, and I'm going to leave it there. Oh, hi, Theo. Well, actually, let me go see what Theo wants. And then, well, actually, I'm gonna show you uh, the Pokemon I just caught. Go see Theo, and then we're gonna end the episode there because why not? So, let's see. Move Pokemon. So, we do have an S51. That's kind of cool. We do have a glass uh, glass slug. We have quirky nature, eh, kind of bad IVs. Half life and nuclear slash. That's kind of interesting. Then we have Nekans with calm nature, shed skin, which is so ironic. Radio acid and nuclear waste. Okay, and then Gligar, who is ground nuclear, relax, some, the only good IV is really a special attack and the same and all that good, Fury Cutter, Half-Life, Nuclear Slash, and Faint Attack. Okay, that's interesting. I think I might be training up some Pokemon as well. Um, we do have Cottony and stuff like that, so... Cast snail, a uh, new pen, which is the egg that we hatched. Um, we got a whole bunch of Pokemon that I would love to train up, be able to uh, evolve them, stuff like that. So I think I might be doing that in some off time before uh, part 18. I'm not sure yet, you know, honestly, just not sure. But we'll find. Well, I'll find out. So, um, kind of want to show you that that's what I've gotten so far. Tell me what Pokemon you would like to see. That That's something I want to hear in the comments below is what Pokemon do you want to see in my team or at least for a little while. Hi Topaz, looks like you're back from helping the Rangers out, huh? Wish I could have helped. My Pokemon are strong enough, but I, I guess it's good people are safe anyway. I'm going to stick around Legend Town a bit longer, I think. I just got 
HMO4 strength from a weird fat guy in a house over there. Please don't do that. Don't, 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 don't call people fat. You know. Um, when, when you have strength, you've got to take the train back to uh, Barol Town and move that rock block on the way to Bay Cole Rainforest, right? I still got to beat uh, Sh Sheldon and get that pixel badge before I can do that, though. After I do that, you better believe I'm going to catch up to you, Topaz. You know, that's kind of cool. So, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. It does help out. And go ahead and comment in the uh, section below. What, what Pokemon do you want to see? Like, if there's any Pokemon that I can add to my team that will uh, potentially, you know, before at least an episode. Roach fail town. Huh. Interesting. So, yeah. that That's what I want to hear from everyone. Alright. Take it easy, everyone. Later.